internet so this will now be my very last formal fashion video upload before we start vlogmas on Friday which I am so excited about so those will be 12 days of vlogmas actually 13 technically um, up until the 25th of December part of it will be my trip in Hawaii so keep an eye out for that in your subscription boxes since this will be my last um, kind of formal tutorial style upload probably then I just kind of wanted to make it a good one so I thought what item of clothing does pretty much every girl have in her closet why a little black dress of course so I'm wearing my latest purchase of one which is from Diane von Furstenberg and we are gonna wear it three ways one of which is actually how I actually wore it on my birthday and I just think during the holiday season you have so many parties with different people that it's just so smart to rewear a dress that you love that you feel confident in it's just economically intelligent and it's fashionably intelligent too because little black dresses are universally flattering and appropriate I thought it might be quite helpful for some ladies out there to do an outfit that you could wear to an office party or also with in your office but with a party to go to afterwards so this one is a little bit more covered up since my dress is a little bit more on the flirty side given that it has sheer um, panels of satin underneath the lace it's nice to just top it off with a little jacket so this one is actually um, not easily available it's from a little boutique in Hong Kong when I was working there I picked it up but you can find these at pretty much any store just look for the fake Chanel sort of look with any kind of pearl or sequin detailing on it in the very sort of classic coloring palette so anything that's going to be a black and a cream or a white is going to look really nice and polished um, since it has pearl detailing on it I chose to pair it with a pearl necklace and I just think it's quite fun and girly and a really good little nod to Chanel since after all the little black dress was her thing as you guys already know if you've watched my history of the little black dress video which I will link down below in case you want to go see it. So I'm wearing my Chanel medium in chevron and it's the emerald color which is so lovely to use at the holidays. If you have a red bag or a green bag it can be a really good time to pull it out. So I'm wearing it with the straps short because I feel like that's a little bit more dressy. And you can see since this is the first shot of this dress I'll show you that it's a little bit of a tulip shape which is very flattering and it sort of flares out a little bit. My shoes you guys may have seen before these are my Kate Spade sparkly pumps. I wear these quite a lot because it's so easy to have a pair of black shoes that you can just take from day to night. So in ordinary daylight you can't really see that these are sparkly at all but once they get under artificial lighting they have lovely tones of blue and green in them. So these gumball drop size pearls were a gift brought back by my boyfriend from Asia. But if you're looking for pearls like these, places like eBay or Etsy are just great to look at because they'll have a variety of colors and sizes so you can find a necklace that basically suits whatever style you are going for. outfit I decided to go bold and colorful and I want to encourage you guys to experiment with colors for the holidays because any beautiful jewel tones will feel actually as festive as red or green which are lovely colors but sometimes not ones that you might have in your wardrobe so go ahead and use what you have I have this bright fuchsia pashmina which is kind of unexpected and fun um, and I paired that with a very bright fuchsia lip gloss as well but I wanted to bring even another punch of color into the outfit so I decided on another accent and that is turquoise and the turquoise mainly comes from my earrings and my shoes and my ring so for my clutch I'm using my Chanel wallet on chain with the chain tucked in I don't know if you've actually ever seen me use it this way before but it's really handy because it's actually very roomy and doubles as a wallet so any bag that has that structure I would highly recommend because it's just so easy to use and convertible for the holiday season um, you can see I'm wearing this really lovely bright turquoise cocktail ring that I purchased from Etsy a few years ago and the band is actually a stone in itself so it's really chunky and lovely and since it 
has the black, it sort of remembers the dress as well. These shoes are from Badgley Mishka. They are my birthday present to myself about two years ago, and they've worn beautifully. They're very comfortable. They have a little bit of black in them, which makes them perfect to wear with an LBD, but they're also ombre. Dangly earrings, if you have some in a bright, pretty color that goes with your outfit. These are actually a bit more of a periwinkle aqua, and they are actually from Macy's last so year. For the very final outfit, I thought I would do a little recreation of what I actually wore on my birthday. For my birthday dinner, we went to a really lovely restaurant called Secret Location. If you want to see what I ate, then check out my Instagram account because I photographed all of it. Um, so for this outfit, it's basically go sparkly or go home because all of the accessories are sparkly. I'm not sure exactly what advice to give on that, other than that you really should go big within reason. So don't wear anything with huge sequins and then pair it with 10 other sparkly accessories. The reason why this works in my opinion, and I just love it because it's so girly and glamorous, is because everything is subtly sparkly. So I know a lot of you guys have been asking me about this necklace from Zara. I'm so happy with it. I think it's some of the most beautiful costume jewelry I've ever owned. You can see it's a bib style necklace and it has an adjustable back so you can wear it longer or shorter. With this dress which has quite a high neck, a very sort of fancy ornate necklace looks really good I think. This little clutch is great if you're not taking too much with you. It's from Anthropology. I got it in their sale a few months ago. It has a little bit of a butterfly go design going on and sequins in black, silver, and gold, which makes it very easy to pair with any holiday outfits. This little bobble on this Lynx of Link London bracelet is just very simple as well and catches the light really nicely. Sparkly accessories are especially great if you know that you'll be going out after it's dark because in subtle, sort of darker, dimmer lighting, like in a fancy restaurant, it will be just the perfect amount of elegance without looking overly disco ball like. This whole outfit was kind of inspired actually by a new pair of shoes which are my birthday shoes for this year, newly purchased, they are currently on sale at Holt Renfrew. These are from Kurt Geiger, which is one of my favorite shoe designers. I love a lot of British shoe designers because they're very high quality. Many of them are actually made in Italy, um, and they've just always served me well throughout the years. LK Bennett and Kurt Geiger are two of my favorites. So these ones are sparkly gold and silver and pointy. So you can see that they are actually a gold background with a silver glitter, and then the heel is a very a light gold and it seems very spindly and unstable but somehow the architectural design of the shoe makes them very comfortable and stable for a stiletto heel. The pointy toe is certainly very current for right now but it's not so excessively pointy that it makes your feet look very large or um, are difficult to walk in for that reason. So I think these are just a really great classic metallic pump. I think other brands that make good ones are Steve Madden, Jimmy Choo um, are absolutely gorgeous, if only they weren't so expensive. Um, and these are right in the middle of that price range. So those will be my three ways to wear this little black dress this holiday season. I hope that you like this video. If you did, then give it a thumbs up and let me know in the comments below which outfit was your favorite. Plus, if you have one particular brand that you like to get little black dresses from, let me know so that I can know too and I can steal your ideas. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you on the first day of the 12 days of Vlogmas. Bye!